What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Jetty Live, and I'm live in effect, man. Hey, today we're going to talk about this. We got to get into this, man. We got to get into this. Before we do, hit the like button. It does well for the channel before we begin. Watch the whole entire video. This is value, free game. I got y'all. I'm going to put y'all on with this one, man. It's, it's a really good topic, really good video, man. So watch the whole entire video, man. Watch it, bro. Okay. So we're going to talk about why your parents want you to go to college. This is mainly for... People that are just graduating high school or, you know, like you're out of high school, you're ages between, you know, 18 to 22, like around, you know what I'm saying? Like it could, it can apply to people who are a little bit older too, you know, in their 20s, but you know why your parents want you to go to college. Simply, the reason that your parents want you to go to college is because that's what they did. Your parents want you to do the exact same thing that they did and that's what they were taught. So they're trying to repeat the cycle. They're trying to go through tradition. That's what they know. So they want you to do the same thing because they only want what's best for you. They know what's best for you. That's why they tell you to go to college, right? Now, here's my opinion about college. College, a lot of people say college is a scam. I don't think college is a scam. Here's a, here's the reason. 100% I don't think college is a scam. I think it's a, it's a scam depending on what you're going to college for. Now, if you're going to go, if you're going to go to college to be a doctor or a lawyer, you got to go to college. You got to go to college to be a doctor or a lawyer. You can't get around that. You got to get your cert your degree, your certification, right? You got to go, right? So, obviously you guys know that typically if you're not getting a full scholarship, you got to take out a financial aid alone, right, for college. So you got to pay every single year tuition, right? Me personally, I think it's ridiculous how much money is for tuition. You know, $10,000 a year, $20,000 a year, $30,000 a year. By me saying that, if you're going to go to college, make sure you're getting a degree where you're going to be making like 100 k a year, where you're going to be making a lot of money. I think it's a scam if you're going to go to college and you're going to be making less money. You know what I'm saying? If you're not going to be making a whole lot of money and you got to take out loans and stuff like that, it's going to be a scam because you're going to get that degree. You're going to go to college, right? I mean, you're going to go to college, you're going to get that degree, you're going to possibly get that job. The job's not guaranteed because there's a lot of other people that got the same degree, same credentials, going after the same job that you get. Hopefully, you can get that uh, that job. You get that job, you're making this high-paying money, and you got to pay off the degree while you're paying your bills as well. And then, pretty much, you got to dig yourself out of a ditch that you put yourself in. You know, you're in debt, you know, so that's what it is. Um, I feel like college is worth going if you have a scholarship, in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? But here's my whole thing. Listen, if you're 18 and you just graduated high school, high school graduates, listen to what I'm saying, man. Really think about what you want to do as a career. Really think about what you want to be, man. Really sit down to yourself, by yourself, and really think about long and hard about what you want to do. Listen to what I'm saying. Like, honestly, not everything in life requires you to get a degree. Like, not every career requires you to get a degree. You don't have to go to college to do certain things. Doctor and lawyer, you do, but a lot of other, th these things you can learn simply online. You can go on Google, you can go online, you can go on YouTube, watch YouTube videos, you can go buy a cheap course for $20, $30, learn from somebody who is from where you at, I mean, where you wanna be, so you can get to where you need to go. You know what I'm saying? Like, there are other alternatives. You can also go to a trade. You don't have to go to university, right? You can get a trade, you know, you can do forklift, whatever the case may be, but, Really sit down and think about what you want to do in life, man. Figure out the career that you want to get into. Like, the reason why college is the only option that parents, you know, really force on their kids is because that's what they did. But personally, they just want you to, um, you know, do what they did and they feel like it worked for them, so it worked for you. At the end of the day, you got to do what's best for you at the end of the day. You are your own person. But if you are living with your parents and your parents is getting on your nerves and telling you what to do and telling you you got to go to college, the only thing to get out of that is you might have to move out your parents' crib, bro. You might have to leave. You know what I'm saying? You got to get your own crib. Because while you're staying in that person's house, they're going to dictate what you do. They're paying the bills. They make the rules. You got to deal with it. It is what it is, man. Unless you're going away for college, you can get away from them. That's why a lot of people, kids, when they graduate high school, they want to go out, off, out to college go out of state university because they don't want to be with their parents. They don't want to be stuck at home. You know what I'm saying? But you got to do what's best for you. You got to figure out what you want to be in life. If you don't know what you want to do, really think about what you want to do first before you go to college because don't just go to college just because everybody else doing. Don't do what I did. Now, I'm going to let y'all know something. I went to community college, right, for about two years. 
took some gen ed class, took some classes, but didn't really know what I wanted to do, which is going to college because that's what you were supposed to do. When you go to college, uh, I mean, not, not when you go to college, when you, when you graduate high school, you get diploma, you're supposed to go to college, right? Obviously, I didn't want to spend a whole lot of money, you know, going to university, so I figured I'd go to community college, it'd be cheaper. But I didn't really know what I really wanted to do. I didn't really know. I was just going to college because all my friends, everybody else was going to college, going to COD because it was cheaper. So I went, you know, I was taking classes, you know, just taking regular classes, and then I still owe like $4,000 of student loan debt, which isn't a lot of money compared to a lot of other people, like... A lot of other people, they owe tens and twenty and hundred thousands of dollars. At least now I know after learning from that, I know what I want to do in my life. I know that I'm going to be an entrepreneur. I'm starting my own business. So now I know what I want to do. But before, I didn't know what I wanted to do. And I just went to college and literally wasted money. Don't waste your money, man. If you're going to college, go for a purpose. Go after it to achieve something, man. And really sit down and think about what you want to do. Because a lot of people go to college, university, and they always change their majors, man. You don't want to be changing your majors, bro. Really sit down and think about what you really want to do. Really picture yourself and envision yourself doing something for the rest of your life for a long time. That you can sustain, that you can build, that you can be, you know what I mean, the best version of yourself, man. So really, really think about that, man. Like, don't do what I did, man. Really think about... Because college is a, is a huge step. Life is a huge step. Life actually happens, bro, when you graduate high school. When you graduate high school is when you become an adult, man. That's when life really starts to happen for you. You feel me? So really take that to consideration and watch this whole entire video. I hope y'all did so y'all can get this value and get this game, man. Y'all give me y'all opinions in the comment section. That's pretty much all I want to talk about, man. That's why your parents want you to go to college. It's just because it's society, it's tradition. You know, that's what everybody else did. But it's up to you to do what's best for you and follow your own path. And if it's the right thing for you, then go out and do it. You know, college is not a scam, 100%. But go for a career, or get a degree that's going to make you a lot of money. It's going to make you a lot of money that's gonna, that's, that you really want to do, that you have interest in. Don't just be doing something just because your parents really want you to do it unless, you know, you don't want to do it. But pretty much, yeah, that's about it, man. If you like this video, hit the like button for me. Comment down below y'all thoughts. Comment down below more video topics. Y'all want me to talk about anything, give advice on. Y'all let me know in the comment section. If you enjoyed it, share it as well to more and more people so more people can see this video. But yeah, man, that's pretty much it. Thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for the support. Stay tuned. I'm dropping videos every single day on the grind during quarantine. So y'all stay tuned on my channel and click that subscribe button for more self-development, motivational videos, entertainment videos. All of that, man. Thank y'all so much. I appreciate y'all rocking with me. Thank y'all for the support. And I'm going to see y'all in the next one. Also, I want to let y'all know this, man. Y'all stay safe out there. And make sure to always live your life for yourself and nobody else. You got... This is your life. Listen to what I'm saying. This is your life. You only got one life. You're blessed to be living a life. You're blessed to be waking up every single day and living your life and being free. So use that to your advantage and live your life, man, and do what's best for you. If you want to go to college, go to college. If you don't want to go to college, sit down and talk to your parents and let your per your parents know what you really want to do with your life. But first, you got to figure that out, man. Really sit down with yourself and figure that out, man, because it's your life. It's your life. You got to live it. You got to go through with it. Nobody else is going to live your life for you. So you got to go do it, man. So it's going to be a hard talk. I have friends personally that are in the situation where they where their parents are traditional, they're Muslim, they're another country, and they go through a certain tradition. They want them to, you know, be doctors, a lawyer, engineer. And my friend personally doesn't want to do that because he has no passion in it. Even though it makes a lot of money, that's not what he wants to do. So he ended up choosing his own path and their parents just accepted it. You know what I mean? Some of y'all parents might disown you, but they disown you, I'm sorry, man. It is what it is, man. You can't change your parents. You might have to just move out, be independent, do your own thing so that you can do what you want to do, man. Sometimes you got to take drastic measures to get to where you want to go to in life, okay? But yeah, man, if you watched the whole video, thank y'all for watching, man. I'm sorry I had to add this in here because this was very, very important, man. Uh, man, this is uh, like... Just really think about what you want to do, man. Take your life serious, man, please. Take your life serious. Really figure out what you want to do, find the right career for you, and live your life for yourself, and be happy, and keep 
being y'all selves, man. Thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for everything. More videos coming soon, and I'm going to see y'all in the next one. Peace.